Don't quit before your miracle happens. Addiction, alcoholism, separation, racism, gang violence, abuse. These were just some of the things that faced me as a 10 year old boy. Beating so bad that they left welts on my body for days. Witnessing my mother's violent boyfriend. Coming home to find my mom in a puddle of blood, shot in the head. Things were different after that. I was different. I had a hole that developed in my soul. A soul sickness that I couldn't escape. Physically, psychologically, emotionally, and spiritually bankrupt. I started running and I didn't stop. By now, I was addicted to every kind of drug I could find to fill that hole in my heart. Homeless at 14 years old, I walked the streets of Ohio and beyond for over 23 years. This is my story, living on a park bench, but it could be any homeless person's story. Like a never ending tornado taking everything in its path until one day God intervened through one person. One person believed in me for the first time. One person made a difference in my life and offered me a way out. I have lived through trauma and discovered resiliency. I have lived through addiction and found recovery. I have been incarcerated and discovered rehabilitation. I have been homeless and found residency. All of these are facts, but the bottom line is that we all have a story. For me, I'm no longer living on a park bench. I'm living my best life now in my own version of park happening. Pick up your copy of Anthony Brown's biography from Park Bench to Park Avenue. Proceeds will go towards helping the homeless find hope and freedom in a home called Brown Manor.